my mother reverted to to islam before me um hers was a, a very so i i grew up in a deeply catholic environment so my my family is serio catholic um and we were the my fa- i come from a family of church builders and and you know so really really tradition but but what was inculcated in us from that from 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 childhood was was the sense of piety belief in god a uh, generosity was was very key to you know how we lived our lives even as young ones we we gave a bit of our pocket money to charity because that was how we were brought up um and and modesty so even though i was catholic my father would you know look at what i was wearing and i certainly couldn't wear micro minis and i certainly couldn't wear something you know so he was quite strict about things like that but that was the kind of catholicism we were we were brought up in um and and my mother was often pointed out within our parish as the model christian woman and and it was and and my mother was very is very spiritual and and she had a spiritual moment in the church a few spiritual moments and that's her story so i i won't talk about it too much but but around the same time we she also met a, a muslim and and the muslim spoke to her about islam and 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 you know it was like 15 days and my mother was muslim so as a teenager it was kind of shock and awe moment but i i suddenly found myself as uh, with with a christian father and and a muslim mother i was and the eldest child at home so you know a lot of in indian families because i'm of indian heritage there's a lot of responsibility on the eldest person's shoulders and um and i'll be honest to to start with i i hated islam i i thought islam covered their their women in in black blankets that was my understanding um and and i also hated islam because it broke up my family to be to be very frank um but um and i was somebody who was interested in religion and so i decided for a long time i decided i was just going to stay catholic but but you know i am my mother's daughter and and when i asked her um so when i finally did start talking to her i asked her mama why did you become muslim and she said to me darling go and read the bible that was all she said to me and so that young age i read the bible page to page um and and there were moments in the bible that made me think there is more to come um and and i talk about you know genesis the, you know the, the the whole creation paradigm and i i have read about how plants and animals came before light and i said actually plants and animals would not have survived without light so there's something happening there and then i read in you know as i kept reading i read about the covenant god made with abraham around you know circumcising your your, your male children seven days you know or so after they're born and i said but christians don't do that and and i started questioning and as i kept reading i came to deuteronomy and in, in deuteronomy i read about you know do not take usury interest and i said but but we christians don't really bother and and then finally i read the gospel according to saint john um and this is where i usually get emotional so forgive me but in the gospel according to saint john i i read about somebody who was going to come after jesus um the somebody would be unlettered he would not speak his own words he would speak the words of god um and in catechism i had read i i was taught that this was um the holy spirit but when i read the bible page to page i knew the holy spirit was always there because before creation the holy spirit hovered above the earth and i said god won't be jesus won't be tell, telling us about the holy spirit again and and for me i began to think that that might be muhammad you know may allah be pleased with him um so i think that was my first inclination that i i might be becoming i might islam might have something to it but but instead of becoming muslim i decided to become atheist <laughs> but but i was a teenager and then but atheism didn't last long so i read about hindu spirituality 
but I, I reckon I was too, you know, used to the notion of an Abrahamic God. And then finally, finally decided to, to read the Quran. And I was, I think I was bowled over quite soon. Um, my mother was away, she wasn't living with us. And she sent me a letter with Surya class written in it. And that became like a little tasbih for me. And I would be saying my rosary with my Hail Marys and my Our Fathers. And then I'd say Surah Ikhlas as well, you know, 11 times. But, but I think Surah Ikhlas and reading the Quran opened things for me, but I can say hand on heart, I became Muslim without ever having read the Quran. I became Muslim after reading the Bible.